Rochelle Clark doesn't have X-ray vision, but she knows what's behind the walls in the buildings she helps architects design. As a structural engineer, she guides the creativity of architects by making sure their ideas make for safe buildings. As a structural engineer, I am concerned with making sure that the bones of a building, as well as the foundation that it rests on, are solid and secure. I work at BVH Integrated Services. I'm responsible for structural design, um, as well as construction administration. Plans from the architect come into the office, and we take a look at them. Through the whole process, we work very closely both with the different um, engineers working on the project as well as the architect. All of those people have to come together to make a building that works. We're on the second floor. We're probably 50% done on the second floor. Uh -huh. After we get the main structural portion of the building done, then we can concentrate on some of the smaller details. A lot of times, architects will want to create a unique structure in the building um, that's more of an artistic kind of a thing, and those things often require special engineering. If you have some kind of a natural disaster, whether it's a big windstorm, a hurricane, an earthquake, um, if things aren't designed structurally sound, um, you can have problems like windows popping out, bricks falling off the building. We can basically build a computer model of the building and then apply the kinds of forces that we would expect to see, and the model will then tell us how the building is going to react. There are some projects where you're doing a renovation of an older historic project, and those kinds of things are very interesting. You have to go back and figure out how a building was built 50, 60 years ago and how you're going to make it work today for the loads that it needs to be able to hold. When I was in high school I was interested in architecture and my talents definitely lie more in math and science and so my mom suggested that I consider engineering um, and that's how I got involved in structural engineering and so now I get to work on um, being part of the process of a new building going up, but um, it's definitely a, a good fit for me. I love going out to the field and seeing the building under construction. It's exciting to see how much they've progressed. It's really a huge sense of accomplishment to know that some lines that I put on a piece of paper is now a building that people can use.